Hi everyone, I'm Joshua Thomas, and it's time for another unboxing video on Felt Road Express. And hey, today we've got the Chicago Express on the Felt Road Express. Huh? Yeah? Yeah? No? Okay, okay. Let's, let's see what's inside. Um, I actually don't know a lot about this game, so uh, I'm definitely interested to see what's inside it. I do know it's kind of an auction bidding game. Um, and I kind of just got it on a whim. So we've got multiple instruction manuals. Um, okay, so yeah, they're in multiple languages. Italian, German, English is right here on top. So that's what those look like. Um, okay, so we've got the actual dials right here and it looks like logos right there. Uh, like I said, I actually don't know a lot about this game, but um, it looks like those are the logos to the different railroad companies or factions. We've got the different boards. Interesting. They're actually very beautiful. No, oh, double-sided, so that's what um, one side looks like. That's Chicago... Oh, no, wait, that's Chesapeake and Ohio Railroad Company right there. And then that's what the back of it looks like. It's uh, just a different setup, it looks like. And we've got the Pennsylvania Railroad Company in red. We've got two more here. Baltimore, Ohio. And the New York Central in green. So that's that. Oh, this is neat. This is something I saw. Um, I'm going to actually poke these out and these little arrows are actually going to go on these meters and that's how we will track the progress of the game so you can see I don't know if you can see it that well this one right here here and here um, and it looks like each of them do something different it looks like that's what you use to put trains on the board uh, let's unfurl the board here and ooh, ooh. okay so there's Looks like there's something on here. It looks like it's dried wax or something. Um, hmm, maybe that's why it was on a discount on Amazon. It was like 70% off. Um, so yeah, I don't know what that is. If, if you know what this like red wax is in the game box, please leave a comment below. Let me know because I have no clue, but let's Okay, so aside from that, let's open this game board. Woo! Huge. What does it look like on the back? First. Um, just says Chicago Express in giant letters. There's that. And now we've got the Black Railroad that's on the board itself for the Black Railroad Company. Oh, flip this around. It looks like only that one spot has that red waxy stuff on it. It's the only thing about trifold boards is they want to stick up like this. So I'll move the camera around. Here is the Black Railroad, which is Wabash. So it looks like it's, well, it's how it's pronounced. Uh, we got some trackers here for Detroit, Welling, and Pittsburgh. Not sure what those trackers will do yet. Uh, and then we got the game board up here with all the hexagons. I love hexagon board games. I don't like squares. Hexagons are my favorite, so that was another thing that kind of attracted me to this game. Chicago's over here. So we'll show you that. Um, and I do know that, okay, yeah, here are, yep, these are the companies and here are their starting areas. So it looks like you choose a company and start there and then your objective is to get to Chicago and then some other things happen. Um, I know this isn't a new game, it's actually a decade old, but uh, it's new to me, so... We've got several cities and a mountain range, the Appalachians. So yeah, this is a very beautiful, well done board. Let's see what else we got in here. This is... Got some more of this red stuff. Not sure what that is. Got all of our awesome game pieces right here. Let's pull these out. We'll just pull some of them out. Oh my goodness, so many game pieces. 
Got the trains right here. Got houses or public buildings, something like that. And I believe that's all the wooden pieces. Oh, there's counters right here, maybe to count points or something. Got the blue. Maybe it corresponds to the blue right there, the blue six. So maybe so. All right. We got all that. We've got the little grommets that will be used to put the needles into these different dials. Um, maybe these are the deeds that I read about. Can I slide this off? Uh, there we go. Now oh, the cardboard is on there to, I guess, protect it. Chesapeake and Ohio Railroad Company, United States of America. I, I'm thinking these are the deeds or something. That's that. There's several of them for yellow. Those are right there, I'll slide these. Yeah, it looks like these don't have any pertinent information on them. They're just what you can use to buy shares in the different companies. So we've got those. There's a bunch of green. There's the green ones. Got blue. And then two of the black because the black only comes under special conditions, so you've got less of those. Oh yeah, it's got a giant black flag right here on uh, Fort Wayne, so that's where that one starts. All right, what else do we have in here? And then uh, it looks like, wow, okay. Um, looks like all we've got left is money. So there's more cardboard backings, but wait, there's more of this. Okay, interesting. So there's some red, maybe that was glue or something holding this, this money to the cardboard. I don't know, well, just let me know in a comment below if you had some kind of red wax in your game when you opened it. There's a $1 bill, 25s. Um, I'm sure there's more than that. There's 25s right there. All these bills kind of got mixed up in here. There's more of that mysterious red wax right there. I'm kind of not happy about that. Ones, 25s, there we go. There's fives right there. For those of you who like uh, paper money, I'm not, I like coins better than paper money. But if you like paper money, hey, here's a game to get. Urgh. And that is all. And the, it's amazing. Look at how, look at the size and the thickness of this box. I mean, you've got that big, thick box right there, and yet I'm actually kind of surprised that this is all that's in there. Um, when I saw this thick box, I was expecting so many more components, but uh, maybe, I don't know, maybe after everything gets sorted, this makes for good sorting, or maybe there's room for expansions in here. But I mean, look at the size of the box. This is where the wooden components went. So look at all that space that's in there and then everything sits on top of here, like the board and everything else. So yeah, all right, so that was an unboxing of Chicago Express on the Felra Express. Uh, well, it's by Harry Wu, so if you enjoy him, um, Queen Games published it. Um, so yeah, if you enjoyed this video, like and subscribe. Be sure and check out some of our other unboxing videos, and we've also got video reviews and all sorts of other videos on different gaming topics. Thanks for watching.